Okay, today is kitchen storage upgrades. Um, we're gonna, I've got a shelf that I'm gonna put above the stove in this space here, moving this microwave up there and then in turn making more room on the countertop. What I've done, I've got two three quarter inch cleats that I anchored up here, I countersunk them, um, ran inch and a quarter screws through so they won't protrude through real bad. And I use these plastic screw caps to cover them with. And those fit in that Phillips lot enough and that's about all of that takes okay we've got the cleats in inch and a quarter screws anchored that in these are oak if you wanted to this is a shelf that I built which is three quarter inch plywood I ran oak on the back oak on the front and for cleaning purposes, I use Formica that I put on the plywood each side. You can do this with almost any kind of wood. We already have the microwave, so I didn't want to go spend $250 on a above the stove microwave that actually fits in here and anchors and so on. So I'm just building the shelf. Um, if you're renting a house, you just have four holes here in these cleats. You can anchor that up, build this shelf. You can do this out of plywood and pine or whatever and paint it. Um, you just need to make sure you've got inch and a half on each side to keep the shelf stiff because it's only sitting right here and here, which will more than enough to hold this microwave. got a slot on the back side. I left the cleats short from the wall back here. So that back end fits in there. And that way the shelf can't slide out. It's pretty much there. And then I drilled two holes on top up here and back here and I've got what are known as shelf clips that you see in furniture and stuff. Drilled those in. Stick that in there and then that shelf can't flop out of there. Works just fine. Shelf is stable, microwave's here. I did pre-drill, I drilled a hole in here, there wasn't one there, but a lot of times there's outlets in the cabinet above the sink. So, I'll clip that up. Get it kind of out of the way. You need to make sure your shelf is deep enough that the feet on the shelf are behind the three quarter on the front. I kept that up a quarter so the microwave can't slide off the front end. Anyway, and there's that. Now we have more countertops. These are ideas, you can do it any way you want. Thank you.